weekends. Uh, the last few weekends have been interesting for me. Uh, I've been involved in funerals, I've had hospital calls, and on Saturdays, as you know, uh, we don't really try to have anything extra heavy, but just take an opportunity, some time to think, reflect, ponder, consider uh, just life in general. Uh, so I've been reminded uh, by these weekend assignments and weekend opportunities uh, to remember that life is frail and that life is brief, the brevity of life. Uh, so today I just took a little time just to thank God for life, uh, for breath, uh, for opportunity, for his manifold provision, for his wonderful blessings, for his merciful grace and kindness. Uh, and then also uh, just to take stock of the fact that um, life is brief. Kind of interesting to me that in both cases, the funerals I was involved in uh, not long ago, one was an octogenarian and man in his 80s, the other was a young girl of 30 years. Uh, but both families remarked, I wish we'd had more time. So um, what I'm thinking about and pondering today is how I can make better use of the time that God has given me. Um, some people might say, well, there's only 24 hours in a day. But guess what? There are 168 hours in the week. Make the most of every opportunity. A great opportunity is to worship with us on the Lord's Day, on tomorrow, High Point Baptist Church, 101 High Point Lane, Cedar Hill, Texas, 8 o'clock or 1045. Uh, if you can't make it to our campus, join us on our live stream platforms, 1045 a.m., Facebook, YouTube, highpoint.org. Hope you've had a wonderful day. God bless you and have a good evening.